thing called the fish philosophy and it's uh, be there, make their day, choose your attitude and have fun. Those are the four philosophies. Um, and you ju it's a choice, you know, everybody that works here wants to be here. It's a personal choice. It's your choice to have a crappy day all day or if you have a, you have a choice to have a wonderful day. Uh, just to get started, we're shoveling about six to seven thousand pounds of ice. Every morning when I'm chopping ice, my shoulders burn, and I've been doing this for a little while now. So I don't know. You just you have to love it, and you gotta you really gotta want to do it because it is hard, hard work on your body. I don't even know how to explain it. It just I worked here one day, and it changed my life. I came here to work for fun for one day. Just because I knew the place, I knew some of the guys, and I was working at a different spot in the market, and so I came, and I thought it'd be fun to work for a day. And so Sam's like, "Come in on this day. You have to work the 12 hours." And I was like, "Okay." And I came in, and it was just the the attitude and the energy, and the way people were treating each other, and the way people were interacting with customers. I've never seen anything like it, and it did like it struck a chord with me. Our biggest thing is just trying to change people's lives you know just people just come into Seattle to hang out at a fish market it's something really powerful that we get to do uh, because they come here for us and we're like ambassadors for the city uh, and for the market and we take a lot of pride in that and we try to make every single person that comes by to see us we, we want them to leave feeling like wow that was an amazing experience We're basically a family. You know, we've worked together a long time. Um, we come from a place of love. You know, we're not, when when we are training new guys, you know, I'm not training you because I want you to not be in my way or, you know, something like that, like from a negative perspective. We train from, I want you to be the best you can be. I want you to be the best fishmonger that I can, I can make you. And that's, that's really the goal here, is just to make, make diamonds, yeah. You know, uh, I started working here, and I was the first female to work here in probably a decade. There's been many before me, but I was the first in a while. And when I started here, I got 20 brothers in a day. And they treated me like I've been here forever. And there is a support that's provided here that is not like anything I've ever experienced. Our bosses truly care about us, like we're their children, which is very rare. The essence is, is really love, you know, coming from that place first. We're not coming from, you know, I, I need to sell this fish so I need you to buy it, you know, buy it now, that sort of thing. We are coming from a place of, hey, I have this really cool opportunity. You know, if you want, you can take this stuff home with you. People come here uh, expecting love from us and it's actually something that we do. Like we have committed to that. And so it's a cool thing. I've never I've never worked anywhere like it where like we show up every day to be with people, but we also sell fish. You know, it's not like we sell fish and then we're here to be with people, it's the other way around. It's it's quite unique. It's not just about the fish it's about the connection and the relationships you get to build with people we have customers from you know all over the country that have shopped with us for decades and that's really powerful that somebody who lives in Maryland will buy fish from a guy in Seattle for 30 years and and that's just that's a big part of what we do is just making it more than just fish and so when you're packing multiple boxes it's easy to get into your head where where uh, I'm just gonna, you don't even care, you're just like a machine putting it in there. So we, we well, back to basics saying that, hey, every package you pack, pack it like it's going to your mom or your girlfriend or your wife or, or, or your fiance. Put it that way so you'll never get a complaint. You gotta come on into the fish market. Hi, guy! Nothing else matters. You just hear you're present and you're hanging out and you're doing your job. That's that's where I would start. I think that if people really tapped into that and locked in, 
that would change everybody's job. Like everybody's workplace would get so much easier if we just hunkered down, chose our attitude, like, okay, I've got all this going on, but I'm at work right now and I'm just gonna be here and I'm gonna have a great day. And everything else you can deal with later, but right now, I'm here and I'm gonna do this. That's powerful. Hey, look at that, Thomas! Go, Bo's ready. Ready? Ready, Bo? CT for Bo! CT for Bo! Yeah.